All right, FloodHSFootball.com here at the 2017 Ocala High School Football Media Day. We got Sal Sumner in the house from down there from Bushnell in Sumner County. Got Coach Lawrence from Coach Lawrence, and then we've got uh, Deontay Grant here with us, joining us here. Uh, Coach, appreciate you coming by, uh, stopping by. Uh, I mean, hey, it's uh, going into your second season as head coach. Uh, things are a little different as, uh, as you transition from – being in the district to having to schedule your full game, the 10-game schedule, kind of just give us a little insight about that process. I know you, you're one of the ones that have told, kind of told me it's a, been a little tedious for, for you all to deal with that in, in, in terms of scheduling. But t tell us how you came through and got that 10 games on the schedule. Well, we uh, first of all, we're glad, glad you had us here. Um, it's always a good day to get the kids out and do this for the kids. We appreciate you all doing this. The uh, As far as the point system and stuff, I, I don't know how it's going to work, but – the um, we always have always set a goal um, every year to win our district. Now we don't have districts. Um, don't even have a conference that y'all are going to be playing in. It was no, it, we we try to join three different conferences. Nobody would let us join with them. And trying to find ten games wasn't easy, but we we did it. And uh, we're doing quite a bit of traveling. We'll travel travel down to. Uh, Avon Park. We'll also play um, St. Pete High School. Uh, we'll go as far north as uh, Trenton High School. Um, so we're playing some teams we haven't played in the past. That's kind of interesting. Um, you know, I always see the environment at Trenton. Um, it's pretty special. Right. I, and yeah. They got some. They, 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 they can sell out those games pretty yeah, quick there. Right. right. So, you know, that's going to be a good experience for our kids. I think we go there this year, I, I think. I'm, don't quote me on that. But um, be a real cool environment uh, for our kids to see. And I know some of our, you know, believe it or not, some of our kids know their kids, um, Deontay being one of them. And um, so, I th I, you know, they always talk about the jungle and stuff and, you see pictures and video, and it's really cool high school environment that you know I wanted our kids to probably be you know involved in. And um, when me and Coach Wiles scheduled, um, we we you know it's, it should be fun. And um, but it wasn't easy finding ten games, it, but we did it. Hey, th th that's the day hey, y'all did it, and that's a, that's the thing. And but I. Uh, Kind of, kind of a little insight. I know y'all graduated a lot of seniors. You know that's a thing. You know that's but that's always a thing. You know they, right. they say South Sumner tradition never graduates. Right. That's you know we always say that the um, we did graduate. I think it was twenty three kids. Um, I believe eighteen starters. Um, so yeah, we, we but graduating twenty three kids is not new to us we we right you know for example this year I think we have right about twenty seniors twenty one seniors so next year we'll be saying the same thing you know hey you graduated twenty one kids you know yeah we uh, but we always do that but y'all the patrol are used to the process even when with Co coach Sherman was you know even coach Sherman was coaching there you know for you for those years you know thirty two years right y'all were hey here comes the next batch of kids here come here they come you know I've, I've been coming but i Deontay, one of your uh, one of your key players that you're going to be relying, relying on this year, kind of this. Uh, let's talk about him a little bit. We'll, we'll hear from him and then talk about a few, a few of your other players that you brought here with me to media day today. Right, um, Deontay is a um, first class kid. He, he works hard in the classroom. Shows those grades with his honors classes and AP class stuff like that. And um, he represents South Central High School to the best. I mean. He's a he's a, a few to draw a picture of a kid and write down things you want. Deontay is is that kid. Um, he plays safety for us. He started out playing linebacker um, when he first got to South Sumter um, from the middle school. And um, over the last couple years, we I think two years ago we moved him to safety. And um, he's a great kid to have. Great team player. And, and speaking of such, you know, you you, you know, you've, you know, the, the tradition you've been playing with at South Sutner, y'all went ten and two last year. Reverge on a spot in the state championship game. That was how close y'all were. I mean, can I just kind of talk about you a little bit about your experience and what you're actually wanting to do? You know, the the, clo the close things out here with your career in South Sutner. And well, you know, of course, we lost, you know, by an inch. We lost by an inch. So right. Basically, you know, it's, I'm not gonna try to put the game in the referee's hands. We try to teach my teammates to. Start strong and finish strong because we started off bad. Mm -hmm. We was playing catch up for the rest of the game. Mm -hmm. So I can't really be too much mad at the referees because we did 
messed it up in the first half. We tried to come back and we lost by an inch or two. So I'm just trying to start start strong, finish strong, and try to give 100% effort on the field at each time. So that's it. I mean, that's that's the thing, you know. It's a, it's the effort on the yeah, field. Yeah. I mean, and, you know, and and coach, uh, you know, I mean, a couple of your other players here that you got, you know, just talking about them, you know, what what do you expect from them, and what you know with them, and how they are going to help Deontay on the field as well. Well, we, we, what we did today is we brought our we have six captains, and um, we brought our captains down, and um, they're all key parts to our team, and they, they're uh, team first type of kids. They're great leaders. Um, we, they each have their own team. Um, in our summer conditioning program, we compete and we give out prizes at the end and stuff like that. And they, they have all six have done a great job um, leading their individual teams to um, to for great effort, um, great attendance. Uh, we average about 90 kids a night at our summer conditioning. Well, if, if you count middle school, we. We're, we're ha- we ha- we ha- Monday through Thursday, we have about 135 kids working out, and um, very blessed to have that. Our kids work hard, and um, but as far as the, the kids we brought today, we brought um, Wyatt Shaw, who's going to play linebacker for us, um, Matthew Palmer, who's going to play safety for us, um, Ricky Tenario, who plays safety and will play some quarterback as well, uh, Zach Harris, who's one of our st- returning starters, Ricky was a returning starter. Um, Zach Harris is one of our returning starters on the offensive line. And uh, Granger Leggett, who will play some what we call power back. Our base formation offensively is power eyes. So Granger plays that power back for us, but he lines up all over the field for us. And um, y'all are more of like a run first team, kind of sort of in a way. I mean, I mean, with that, I mean, is that, is that, is that, is that, is that well, we the, ha- more of the case? Of- well, we have, you know, last year we were. There's other times where we're past first team. So, it's just, if, you know, whatever our kids can do, that's what we – Y'all try to, to model the, 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 the right. playbook around to what they can do, not what the coach wants to do. That's right. And that's probably a good that's, – that, 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 that's an awesome way to go, you know, because, uh, you know, sometimes you see it as like, wait a second, are you doing what you're supposed to do for – Right. It was like last year, you know, our fullback was 250 pounds, our power back was 240, mm-hmm. our tailback was 230, 235, and our quarterback – was a was a midget and but could fly, and so you know our offensive line averaged about two seventy five, two eighty, and I mean who ain't gonna run the ball? So right. um, that's that's what we did, and we came up just a little bit short, but you know we still had a great season. Hey, and it sounds like hey, you, you, I, I mean I, I'm you know, what what are your expectations for this season now? I mean considering that, are well, you consider we don't have a district to go after that we're on a you know, just try to win each game, and I'm not sure how the point system will work. Hopefully we'll make it into the playoffs. We'll see. Uh, I do know this. We start the season with 27 points. That's a good thing. It is. Um, our schedule, nine of the ten teams we play uh, have made the playoffs the last couple of years. So we start the season with 27 points, where some teams don't. So that's we're ahead of the game that way. Um, so we'll see. I, well, it would be interesting to see how it works out at the end of the season. Once the season's over with and we can go back and look at it, um, I'm sure I'll talk to Frank after the season. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he, he will do opposite of what I ask him to do. We'll, we'll see what happens. So, but hey, I wish that wish out something the best of luck this season. Appreciate it, Coach Lawrence. Appreciate it, Deontay. Thank, thank, thank you for coming, stopping by. Thank thanks, you. Thanks for having us.